just got one more thing to say. If you love your job, switch on. I've just arrived at Sky Sports. Soccer M is filmed over there in Unit 2, but first, we have a script meeting. Welcome to Soccer Aim and Pitts National Break is done. Back to normal this weekend. 90 minutes all out attack coming up. Full press, no let up in gym. Right, cones, check. Clipboard, check. Whistle, check. Harold Poborski, check. Because <laughs> he's, yeah. And then we'll rehearse Shockers at 8.50, then you know the drill and how am. Dream team, and then what are you up this to? Is, um, Making the magic we're happen. The we are, we are, we are. Before we head into the studio, I thought I would take you into the Soccer AM props cupboard. Now, it is a little bit messy because there's so much stuff, but this is where we keep all our footballs, football shirts, anything that we get sent in. Here's my favorite part, all the costumes that we've had over the years. And these are the Shocker Saturday jackets. Let's go live. Two roll cuts. What's your role on a Saturday morning? Well, I'm the producer of the show, Kels. I'm basically the annoying voice in Jimmy and Fenner's ears, telling them to do this, do that, shut up, move on, all that kind of stuff, and just generally just keep the show on track. So give us one of your best VOs. You might remember me from such classic, classic, oh, <laughs> warning. This following clip contains, oh, I missed go, 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 go. Oh, Warning, the following clip contains skill of an obscene nature. Pre-match routine. My pre-match routine is uh, porridge. Yeah. Uh, I have a it's cold now, but I have that. I don't want it, but no. I just force it down uh, and a brew. Yeah. And then I just uh, go through this. If people don't come in and interrupt me. Oh, so live. I mean, yeah, yeah. Read the read the room, mate. Now it's time to take you on a little tour of the studio. As you can see, we've got the posters on the wall. They're all selected during our pre-season. And the taglines, we come up with those as a team, apart from that one. We normally have the Soccer AM sofas, but due to social distancing, we are now using kit skips. Fenners is about to take the hot seat as we rehearse Shocker Saturday, bringing you all the Soccer Shockers. <laughs> It's hard coming out here, trying to make you guys laugh. When inside, that's the last thing that I feel like doing. It's your job. <laughs> it's not my job. <laughs> Fenners, how do you get into character? Not now. Jack, welcome to Soccer AM. How are you feeling? I'm, I'm buzzing, I'm buzzing. I'm looking forward to it. Soccer AM debut? It is, it is. And uh, I got to kick a ball before I go on air because I don't, I can't remember the last time I kicked one. And you brought with you a few West Ham shirts? Earliest one I've got today is like 2000. So wow. I've got like, this one's 94. I've got one from like 90, 94 as well, the home one. And I just like having a bit of history. So, and they'll only get more special. This is the scene doc. These boys are responsible for making sure all the big stuff gets moved into the right places. This is the famous John Arna Risa Arena. The grass is all artificial, still concrete underneath, mind you. At the start of the season, we were gifted a beautiful box goal. Right now, we're going to be rehearsing some of the live items on the show today. We have You Know The Drill Live and Pro-Am. Mark is on the steady cab. Morning Mark, how Hello. you feeling? All right, good thanks, ready. How hard is it to operate that bit of kit? Reasonably difficult, it takes years of practice. And it's quite heavy, isn't it? This one's only about 25 kilos. Ooh. Good morning, Jimmy Bullard. All right, Sam, what's happening? How are you? Oh, tired today, <laughs> girls. Very tired, a little bit leggy. Where's that West, that West Ham shirt, mate? Sorry, I woke up, he's on me already. <laughs> Just do your gig, John. Alright, why is it run on me? It's a drill, a passing drill. Danny Canley over there, the legend, he's got us a nice little drill. Um, it's all about the number nine, nine finishes, some little peel offs, little one time finish, blindly little drill this.
Unbelievable. I'm blowing. I'm not fit anymore. I'm not in condition to play football. Don't know about you, but, but you are the top goal scorer in your Sunday league team, right? Yeah, it's, it's not the greatest level ever <laughs> in the world, but you know, if any people in front of you. <laughs> well, how are you feeling about it? What he said. <laughs> exactly. Still trying to catch your breath. Oh, you I honestly am. Uh, I'm tired. <laughs> Going to bed. To be fair, we normally only do it for, with, with three attempts, but I've been watching Jimmy recently and he looks like he's struggling for a little bit of fitness, so I thought we'd, uh, we'd, we'd work on that a little bit for him. And this is one from your footballing rival? Yeah, this is it. It's one from our coaching curriculum, yeah, so it's one that we do with our number nine. So it's all about reactions and then movement, so it's all about trying to get your hips in the right position to then make the finish easier. Show me something, Pete. With the crossbar kick, what I do? Like, uh, that's there. I just crossbar. Not bad, not bad at all. Cross parking. See you later. That's it for today's video. We are about to go live on air, so I need to make myself scarce and get inside. Thanks for watching this. If you've enjoyed it, please do hit the like button and subscribe to the Location Football YouTube channel. Good.